Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing something a little bit different. Uh, it's the Instagram makes my sim challenge. I don't know if it's a challenge, but I'm going to call it a challenge anyway. Uh, so, yeah, I put a poll up on my Instagram account. And if you don't know who I am, it's so simly on Instagram. I'll leave the link down below where you can also click the little link in my on my channel page. Is that what you call it? I don't know. Um, <laughs> uh, so yeah, you can you can follow me and like me on there if you want to. But uh, I just yeah, I've done the video. I've I've done the video. Of course, I've done the video, Kelly. I did the poll up on on my Instagram page a few days ago now, at last week sometime, and because I wanted to get it ready for today, obviously. Um, so I put up a poll, that's what I've been saying for the last two seconds, and I said cast a video for next week, vote on the poll, and it was either what gender is our sim, a girl or a boy, uh, coloured hair, light hair or dark hair, which got 50%, and I got 67% for a girl and 33% for a boy, so it's a girl, um, and then I said alpha or maxis, and maxis won by 67%, alpha was 33 and eye colour was either light eyes or dark eyes, which was both which was both 50%. So the ones that were very, very even with each other, I made sure I sort of like put the eyes eye colour in the middle. So instead of going for a more bluey or a more brown, I went for like a green, greeny kind of colour, which is I don't know, it's still light but it's dark because it's got that little bit of brown, hinder brown in it, so I thought that was quite pretty. I also did light brown here because it's sort of light but it's dark as well so I did light, light brown here. Um, then I said will they be slim or curvy and curvy got 83% so we've got ourselves a cute little curvy sim on our hands people. Uh, and then I did long hair and short hair which was right in the middle so I put you know mid length here and then the style was preppy, goth, country, flamboyant or casual and country won on the pole. And then I said bad or good and they both got 50% so we've got ourselves a little a little smack bang in the middle perfect sim I reckon. <laughs> so I hope you can sort of real realize my logic behind this like the the eye color and the hair color I wanted to keep them sort of in the middle because it wasn't either or 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 either or I'm very bad at my English today <laughs> even though it's my first first language my main language I don't know I can't speak anything else so this is what we're dealing with uh, <laughs> um, so yeah Jenny grew up on a farm she is a bit like me because I grew up on a farm I, I grew I grown I was brought up on a farm <laughs> <laughs> I was brought up on a farm myself. We lived on farms for many years. We're always moving to different places, but um, uh, yeah. So I kind of know what Jenny's gone through because I, I myself am a country girl. I live in this, not in the city. I do live in a little estated area where it's very out in the sticks, meaning it's away from everything. So it's it's really nice where I live, and I'm surrounded by trees and you know just nice green hills, and it, it's really pretty. Um, so I'm still in the country. My whole family loves being in the country, and uh, little Jenny is the same because she was also brought up on the country. She knows how to farm, you know, do her crops. Uh, don't know how to milk the cows yet because there's no cows in the Sims, uh, and she knows how to do her laundry. You know, she's very earthly she doesn't even have a proper washing machine because you know it's it's not the same as doing it in the tub with a board <laughs> so yeah she's you know she's just you know very busy woman I made two looks for her because you know every country girl needs to have a dress in their closet because they love to party country people love to party uh, <laughs> so I made her a little dress dress for her formal and I did her hair and did her makeup and yeah she turned out really great I love her I'm not a big fan on Maxis match 
but I wanted to step out of my comfort zone and give my subscribers the option to see what they want to see too. So everyone wanted to see Maxis match, so I sort of brought the game because I wanted to please my subscribers. I wanted, you know, to see something they haven't seen on my channel yet. I think I've done a Maxis match versus Alpha CC, but there wasn't. That wasn't the best video, I'm going to say. I wasn't that great back then, but I'm still learning. I'm probably not great now, but I'm still learning. <laughs> so, um, sorry if I'm a little bit out of breath. I've been zooming around with the vacuum cleaner. And, uh, yeah. It, it, it's a big house, so I was running around trying to get my 20 minutes on my vacuum cleaner. Because that's how lo long my vacuum cleaner lasts for, so... I was running. I was running for my life. So, uh, yeah. So there's that. Sorry if I'm out of breath again. Um, so, I made... I was... Now, yeah, I was looking for for country-inspired clothes, CC-wise, and I couldn't find anything. I don't know how to work Max's Match clothes, okay? I'm rubbish at it. I'm very good at my alpha because that's so easy to find. I either go on Simsdom or what's the other one? The Sims Resource. But uh, I went on all I went on all the Tumblr accounts and I just I couldn't find anything. I couldn't use them, so I thought uh, I'm just gonna deal with what I've got in game. And actually, there's like a little section where where clothes are sort of inspired. So they had boho, hippie, and all sorts of things, and I found the country tab, I'm like, this is so handy, I want to use this, so I did, and I, uh, I was going to go with those, those jeans you would have seen before, but I found these Daisy Duke shorts, and I loved them on her, they suited her body perfectly, and I loved how they, they sort of hug her curves, and the pockets are sort of at the bottom of the shorts, you know, so I loved that, and I loved the brown belt, so I was finding a top, to sort of be tucked in, and all the nice looking tops weren't, weren't tuck, tucked in, so I found this one, and I really liked it, because it just, it went with this style, and the main reason why I wanted to have shorter pants was because of the boots, I fell in love with those boots, I know they've been in the game for ages, but I haven't used them, and I kind of like them on her now, it, it's just very, very fun and funky, and I love her. I wanted to do little earrings too because she just needed something to make it sparkle even more. So I did some earrings. And I also did, I was trying to do a necklace but I don't think the top was letting me or, or the earrings weren't, I don't know. It was, and, that, and they are in-game in game items so I don't know what was bugging it out. Um, we're on the dress, okay we're on the dress. We're on the dress and we're choosing a pretty, pretty frock. Frock dress. <laughs> Don't know where frock came from. It's such an old-fashioned word. I was going to go with that dress there, but I thought, nah, it's not not formal enough for like if they go to a town hall and there's a function on. And I just wanted something something to sparkle off of her. I've used sparkle quite a lot on this video. I don't know why, but uh, we're going with it. <laughs> um. And I'm thinking that country people, like, if there's there's a function on or there's, like, a party, they'd wear the best. And I mean, like, not just a plaid shirt and some jeans. Maybe the guys would, but the girls, I'm sure they would, you know, put the best amount of effort into looking, you know, just super, super hot and, you know, do their hair, their nails and their just everything. They'd want to be the best versions of themselves. And, you know, they can they can say to people, like, we can dress up. You know, we're not just country folk. We can dress up and look good just as much as anyone can. I wanted to go with that dress there and that one too as well. But I'm thinking, nah, it's too mumsy. Like, I really like those items. I think they're really cool. But they're just, they're just not there. So I found this one. I loved, loved the swatches on this dress. I think they're so pretty. And they just, oh, I loved them. I loved them so much. I think she looks gorgeous in all of them. I had a hard time choosing the one I liked the most. But I think we got there in the end. I was tempted to go for that pink flowery one and that one there. 
But I went with this one instead because I thought that her skin tone matched it a lot better. I think that just the blue seemed to warm up her skin even more. And uh, yeah, so we went with some cute little shoes as well. I think the sort of heels. I was going to go with wedges on her as well, but they just, they didn't look right. So we just went with normal heels and heels. <laughs> oh, golly. I'm tired already. It's like quarter to quarter to ten in the morning and I've done dinner. I've done the half of the vacuum cleaning. I'm doing this video that needs to be up very, very soon. And I've got a plan for Thursday's video as well. I think we're nearing the end, guys. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment down below. Tell me what you think. I always love reading your comments. And subscribe if you want to see more. It's free. I'm always here, Monday and Thursdays. And if you want to see even more of me, which, you know, is just wonderful, <laughs> you can follow me on Instagram. I'll leave the link down below. Even Twitter. I'm sort of still not on the Twitter game yet, but we're getting there, okay? I promise we're getting, we're getting somewhere. Uh, so, yes, thank you guys for watching. I hope you're doing well. I'll see you Thursday. Bye.